Because otherwise I gotta go like use items and shit. I should also save it just in case. I don't know when the next thing's gonna pop up. Ooh, like that big old monster right there. Goddamn. Good job, you beat the easiest one. Yeah, no shit. What I, like I thought that one was gonna be the hardest one. As you open the chest, a number of trapped screaming souls come whirling out. Eh, that's probably normal. Most likely. Tiger heart? The chest is empty. Your screams of disappointment resound off of its wooden walls. Tiger heart? Do I have one of those already? It sounds familiar, but is it? Strength, defense, attack. Oh, but it also prevents seal. So basically your magic attack and defense go down big time, but your strength and defense go up big time. So basically, if you're never going to use magic, this is a good move. But you also get wrecked by magic. Like, it's actually not a bad one for Vander, because his magic defense already is ass. Looks like another open and shut case. Oof. Sorry, better luck next time, Woot. There's nothing in the chest but spiders now. They all stare at you and clap. Bravo! Jormun Gandir. Jormungandr. I had saved some coffee for you, but then it was taken in a mug. I just read that one! You killed it. You killed the joke. It already happened like two minutes ago. This chest is pleased that you have returned. You can be its friend. Its special awake friend. <laughs> okay. Not creepy. You gaze into the empty black void of the chest, and for a fleeting moment, you feel very small. I also feel like I've read that one before, but maybe not exactly. That's a creepy face-hugging looking monster. I'm avoiding the fuck out of everything right now. All right, next floor, here we come. Keep your body moving. Keep it moving. All right, Celestial Bomb. You obtain the Sword of the Ancient God Kings. Just kidding, it's empty. Lame. Remember the stuff you took from here last time? Yeah, the chest was trying to afford chest college. Guess it'll have to start over again. Wow, I'm sorry. Chest college? You wonder if you could use arts to turn this chest into a small wooden bathtub. Water would probably be fine. Fire to heat it, likely not. You briefly wonder how many jelly beans you could fit in this treasure. I've read that before. Okay, so we're probably, yep. I think we're at the point of the next boss fight because this is the next locked door, y'all. Can we have like tents? That's what I want right now, a fucking tent. We can like heal everything without needing to waste items. I got plenty of EP charges, it's cool. Everything else should be fine. Pop a real save, and let's get ready to fight the next Ouroboros member. And I'm assuming it's just going to keep going in order. So, you know who's up next. If you know the order, of course. About goddamn time. Huh? Huh? I didn't bring Zen though. She probably should have brought Zen. Walter the Dire Wolf. That's him. Walter, so you'll be up next. I guess I'm something like an obstacle. Yeah. More importantly, kids, ain't Zen with you? He's certainly on standby aboard the Arsai. I'm afraid you misjudged if you thought he would be here. Shh. Uh, if you'd like, we could give him a message. <laughs> we can take one to Killika, too, if you... Don't even try being thoughtful. Ah, well. No use getting angry if he's not here. Let's just get this over with. All right. Let's fight, then. Wow. How uneventful the dialogue is if you don't bring the right characters. Good lord. Here we go. Hope you can put up half the fights in, Wood. We'll see about that, bitch. 
All right. I am tempted actually to use Zin instead of Vander. I'm not a big fan of Vander actually. I don't like his moveset that much. Maybe after this fight, I'll go get him. Maybe I'll just go switch my party completely. I'd rather use Zen and maybe somebody besides Julia. I don't really like Julia's moveset either. I just like that she has way good magic. That's about it. Like, just as good a magic as Chloe, pretty much. And she's higher level, so it's like... She has more HP and all that, so it's very tempting to just use her. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, um, what are we doing? Morale. Start there. Oh, great. Start with your S-break. That's cool. Cool. Really, really glad. Okay, so I don't remember what status effect that is. Stun, maybe? I don't really remember what it's called, but that's a shitty way to start. Can't reach him, huh? Probably worth taking him out first, though. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is a bad start. This, this is a real bad start. I think if I lose, which I may just let happen, actually. Um, maybe what I'll do is I will uh, put uh, spread them out more so the AOE doesn't fuck my shit up. Basically. You little. You little. Because the AOE fucking my shit up right in the beginning was a, was a problem. Uh, let's see. I haven't given up yet, though. We're going to still try to salvage this if we can. How unexpected. We never give up and we never surrender if we don't have to. If I can get Julia back on her feet, we might be able to salvage this still. For now, we can keep chipping away at Dire Wolf Man. Ooh, the high impact is no bueno. Okay, we got Julia back on her feet. This is good. This is good. Can't reach douchebag. Can't reach the juice bag. Alright, I would very much like to bring back other dude though. Hoping him being all the way back there will be a helpful thing. Let's do double zeros, because that's not okay. That's definitely not okay. Alright, Mr. Mr. Dude, you're back in. Okay, so my strength being down just gives me zeros. This is a problem. Why is strength both buffed and debuffed? Because this game's got weird buff system. I want to morale everybody. I'm about to just move, like, right here. Motherfucking asshole. <laughs> as soon as I move her, he goes and punches her and kills her. What a fucking asshole. I mean, with his strength being zero right now, he's kind of being useless. Fuck! Okay. This is becoming a problem now. Good to go! Dude, she's already out of EP. Good lord. Get up, fool. Break yourself, fool. I need, I need to wait till the strength debuff wears off, man. It'll wear off after that turn. Okay. This is good. This is good. Alright, I'm gonna use EP charge on her right now. 
because we kind of need it. We're good to go. Okay. Back to smacking Walter around a bit. Uh, what does her move do? Just the AoE. In this case, she's going to heal herself right now. Now Joshua can go back to slapping him around. Booyah, booyah. Shit, and then he does his dang AoE. Only on Josh, though. That's good. That's good. I'm okay with this. Well, I was okay with it until he killed him. God damn it. Okay, well, we're going to use another Celestial Bomb because whoops. We're good to go. Okay. He's back. Um. I just want to do morale on my homies. That's all I really want. I just want to do morale on my homies. I just want one morale. Let me get a Stell's turn, for the love of God. Fuck! Stop killing everybody, you pieces of shit! Ah, fuck off. That's all I wanted, though. I just wanted morale, especially on Joshua. Fuck off, man. your turn to keep shipping away, bro. Just keep shipping away on that fuck. Don't you worry about anything else except for chipping away on that fuck. Chip, chip, jam, jeru, baby. Chip, jam, jeru. Chip, chip, jam, jeru. I'm literally letting Josh just do it. So I can focus on the damage. I'd love to hit him with a clock up. Again. His strength being down is annoying. Kind of makes him useless over there. Hell yeah. Oh, he doesn't have his fucking CP, man. Couldn't do the double strike critical hit, damn it. Or... Oh, I don't like when Josh gets slapped around and his strength is now debuffed again. Yay. God, this strength debuff is annoying. Kill yourself. Gulia, Gulia, I'm gonna have you heal Joshua. Meanwhile, I'm gonna have Joshua try to hit this guy. Alright, Estelle, I'm gonna have you actually go smack this fucker because somebody's got to do something. This still feels winnable, even though it's, like, shitty right now. That zero's gonna suck it. Ugh. Hate it. Absolutely hate it. I'm just gonna have him do heals. Fuck it. Meanwhile, I'm gonna have her do this. Strength is still down, right? Stop wasting a CP. Dude, stop with the bullshit, man. It's almost better when you actually kill somebody, because then at least my strength doesn't get to stay down. It's fucking annoying. Do -do 
do 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 Fuck you. Dude, it's still can be forever. I love her. I love her. Strength debuff is still there. God damn it. Go away, strength debuff. Annoying. Me. Thank you. Alright. I'm gonna use Tear All on a step. This guy's not gonna squander his fucking move. Got a critical hit, I'm gonna use it. It was worth it for the critical hit I got on him. He's almost dead, man. Strength debuff again? Ah! You are such a piece of shit. God, that's so annoying. You are such a piece of shit. God, I hate this guy. Okay, what about... Can I just do this? She doesn't have a strength buff right now, though. Fuck it. He's almost dead. He's so close. I got a critical hit. That was worth it. That was worth it just because I got a critical hit on it. Hell yeah. Good to go. That debuff is pissing me off. It's pissing me off so hard right now. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna morale boost this guy. And he's gonna get up in there. He's gonna finish this fucker off. Oh, hell yeah. Now who's winning, bitch? Alright, well... Still gotta deal with these annoying pieces of shit, but we are in a much better situation now that we got rid of douchebag. Somehow salvaged this victory on the first try. At great cost, of course, but it happened. I almost feel like it's so pointless to do anything until the strength debuff wears off. Go away, strength debuff. You're just making this take forever. literally just waiting at this point. Alright. Can the strength debuff go fuck itself? Nah. Strength buff does not get rid of debuff. I've already tested this theory. Can't you see that I have strength up and strength down at the same time? Can't you see? Right, anyway, it's the fucking debuff finally wore off, so we're good now. We're good to go now. Just a matter of time. You know what? Let's use a chain attack. Who need, who's got 30? She does. Okay, so... Let's start with this dude, and maybe Estelle and Joshua? I can have everybody chain attack. Fuck it. Wow, I love when one of them misses. Was, was that one miss, or was that two? I didn't even catch how many misses was there. That was annoying. Also, that probably wasn't the best time to do that because I didn't have strength buffs on everybody yet. Very much like to get those strength buffs going, though. Alright. Now we're looking good. Let's finish this last motherfucker off and we're good. Always comes down to these dang mechs, but we good. We good. All right. Two Ouroboros motherfuckers down. 
These fights are goddamn marathons. EP charge three. Damn kids. Oh, come on. Where's this kids thing coming from? Ha. You're one who's doubled over from fighting a pack of children. Stupid shrieking birds. Walter, you don't really have a reason to stay, do you? We, however, have many reasons to keep going. Do you still want to fight? Joshua. Huh. Damn, but you know how to turn a guy off, Fang. He's bringing in his Turks helicopter to help him get out of here. Whoa, wait! You wanted to carry a message? Cool. Tell Zin the match is held up till next time. So, later, kids. Try not to let the faceless up there eat your brains. Faceless? Eat my brains? What? He's gone. He knew that his chance to settle things with Zen had passed. He'll like be like Blue Blanc. He won't trouble us again. Cool. Blast. I'd intended to make him pay here and now for his crimes in the capital. Yeah, he did put Chloe and Her Majesty in danger and hurt a lot of people. But the real criminal here is Wiseman. The enforcers just responded to his request. True. I still feel unsatisfied, but we should press on. Either way, we can proceed now. Let's use the terminal to unlock the gate. You got it. So I'm gonna double check my item count right now and decide if I wanna go back and like buy some items. We should be okay right now though. And we, see, and we do seem to be picking up, like, Celestial Bombs and Tyrol Bombs and stuff in Treasures, so... I'm not tripping too hard, I don't think. Because I used a bunch of Celestial Bombs there. I used probably, like, five. Yeah, I think we'll be okay for another fight. I'm just going to let it ride for a little while and see how far we can make it without having to backtrack for some heals. Alright, until we hit the next floor, we won't worry about saving it. Well, that's our first random battle up in here, because I accidentally ran into it. It's all good. Let's, let's, let's give them a taste. Open their mouth. Give them a taste. I like when I get the strength buff and do buff at the same time. It's pretty sick. Pretty sick. Coin toss. Ooh. Okay, I do not care for anything that these things are at all. Okay, absolutely hate this fight. Already. Cool. Look at all these debuffs I have. It's ridiculous. All of my movement is fucked. I don't have any CP either. Wow, these coin enemies are the worst. They are truly the worst. They just drain all your CP, they hit you with debuffs. I'm not a fan. Not a big fan. It's mostly bullshit because they keep knocking you back also, so I'm not a not a big fan. Not a big fan. Really glad I ran into this fight. Feels real good. Um, the worst random battle ever. Like, truly the worst. Not a big man. They're supposed to heal you sometimes? Well, that has happened, like, once. So my RNG is garbage. They're just killing the shit out of me, dude. Why didn't I... I just want to kill one of them. Please. This is the fucking worst. 
Thank you. Wow, they just attack me normally after all that. After all that. Go fucking eat massive dick. That was annoying as shit. Also, Estelle went up a level, so I don't have to worry about healing her MP, which is good. That was atrocious. I did not care for that fight. Let's try not to run into any more of that bullshit. Good lord. That was some horrible ass RNG, I agree. Also, that floor was hella short compared to the last floor. I'm okay with this. Shorter floors mean straight into the next boss fights. These boss fights are taking like 15 minutes plus a piece, so I'm okay with just getting right into the next one. We still got at least, I mean, if we have to fight every single World Boros member, not just the ones we've already fought, that's still four more to go besides wise men and whatever the fuck else there's gonna be. Cause that, cause I'm assuming we're gonna have to fight with Low and Campanella at some point. I mean, unless they're just gonna be left by the wayside. I knew that was gonna be a monster box. These guys again, huh? Okay. Forgot how I handled these guys last time. Eventually took them out with slow, concentrated attacks. Am I going to change party members? Uh, I mean, so far, no. Doesn't look like I am going to, Terra. Also, hello, Lamer Gamer. What's up, man? Welcome. Or should I say, welcome back. Motherfucker down. Probably should have done imp impede on that guy, but he's only gonna hit him. Let's just hit him with uh, Josh with the heal. Guess I could have hit Vander with it since he was gonna get hit anyways. You will always be here, Lamer Gamer. That's a that's a mighty. Uh, claim to make. We shall see if you can hold yourself to that. I will always be here. No Alright, this battle is all but over now. It's over, it's over now, it's over, it's my turn now, it's over, the game's shut down, not sorry. That's that. Level up Commander, good stuff. They definitely give you a lot of good items. Prometheus boots. This chest was once full of wondrous treasures, then you came along. Also, I just remembered I got a uh, piece of equipment earlier that I never equipped. Must have been a male. Ooh, look at that. Oh, that looks so good. Oh, but I don't want to give it to Estelle. Look at that move. Oh, the move goes down. Her move is so good, though. Seven, seven, nine. Her move is so good, though. Okay, this actually helps Julia across the board, though. Wait, can I just give this to anybody? His agility and his dexterity goes down. Or I can just give it to this guy. give it to her. Speaking of that armor, it must be a dude's armor. Wait. Is it not? I picked up armor earlier. What the fuck? I definitely picked up an armor. Maybe it's only for a specific character? Oh well. You can be as disappointed as you want, Tara, but this is my playthrough, so you will listen to every goddamn word that I have to say, and you will like it. <laughs> I already did the bring the right characters thing earlier in the game. I didn't feel like doing it again. I feel like using who I want to use. 
Even if I switch characters, I probably would have just brought Zen and Chloe, and that would have been my party. Ah, it's empty, but if you put your head in here, you can hear the ocean. Heard it, been there, done that. Ugh, must we go through this again? More Sepith. If you could read this, well. Well. Shine Sphere? Don't flip your lid, flip mine. Lily Necklace? Isn't that just like a confusion defense? This chest may not have anything in the way of riches or possessions, but it's filled to the brim with hope for the future and love for the world. What an optimistic treasure chest. There's nothing in the chest, but sometimes it's good to pretend. Sometimes. Other times it's mean to pretend. Alright, next Ouroboros member up, which must mean it must be time to fight the illusory bitch. The bitch of illusion. Bewitching Belle, that's her name. I was trying to remember what he was, she was called. Bewitching Bitch, here we come! Not quite who I was expecting. That's her. Ah! Oh! The Bewitching Belle. Hello, Luciola. How strange. I was certain Charizard would be here. It seems my fortune telling still needs some work. Sheer is helping protect the Arsai. Sorry to disappoint, bitch. You still intend to fight us? Hmm. Well, in truth, I don't owe the professor anything at this point. I could just walk away. But to be honest, I didn't think you would actually defeat Blue Blanc and Walter and make it this far. If I may be a little selfish, I'd like to see how far you've come myself. More of these spirit bitches. Blast! Blast! And remember, if you can't defeat me, you aren't possibly ready for the three who wait above. Show me that you can break the spell of the bewitching bell. The three? I mean, obviously, Ren is one. Wiseman and Lo? Maybe Campanella's not actually going to show up in the final. Maybe we've already done with him. Maybe he's already kind of moved on. I guess we'll just have to wait and see. Oh, I don't have enough CP to morale right away. Good start. Okay, this is going to go well. I should focus on her, probably. I don't know. I know one of these things is weak to magic and the other is weak to attacks, right? Or something like that. I mean, they all seem to be weak to earth magic, or at least not immune. Whatever, let's just start with some buff shit. Oh lord, here comes the special already. Tempest Dance, baby. Oh, this fight is something? Well, here we go. Should have probably checked if they have, like, the can't hit this guy with physical attack. Let me double check here. Okay, so this guy, invulnerable to arts. This guy, invulnerable. No, spirit that offends Lucio. Okay, well, whatever. Wait. So this one's invulnerable to art attacks. So I can hit it with physical attacks. But man, that hundo is so weak. The weakest hundo you've ever seen. I'm already kind of hating this situation. Oh great, now there's multiples of her. Just what we needed. Just want to make sure everybody gets that heal. Well now that there's three of that bitch. will be too big of a problem for her. I'm not going to be attacking. Alright. Goal is to just fuck this bitch up as good as you can. 
Can we go back to Batman Lamer Gamer? Not tonight, sir. Tonight we're beating this game. That's the plan. We will go back to Batman soon. Not today. Can you please have your turn already? I just want to focus on this bitch more than anything. I assume Rio's got to be pretty close to finishing up that AI Somnium Files. I imagine he'll show up when he's done. He'll get here before we're done, I'm sure. Do another area heal. Damn, that 3k per hit though, that's crazy. Powerful slash into oblivion, huh? Just wanna see how that would do. How that would fare. Alright, we're gonna use this moment to heal Julia Gulia. We're gonna use this moment to heal Julia Gulia. After I got impeded on. Uh oh. Uh oh. Well, that hurt. Well, that hurt. Oof, okay. Well, that's game over on that fight. Damn. This is bad. What are you supposed to do about that move? Just make sure you're healed up, I guess. Good lord. I just, all of a sudden, I just lost. I just took one attack. Okay. Alright, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna hit myself with a sweet crap. I was just looking for a buff. Maybe I'm better off killing off more of these actual other enemies. Dude, her lack of CP is disturbing. I really want to use this, but I don't. Are we to like the earth stuff? You know what? Let's go ahead and do that. Let's take advantage of that. We'll just do this one. Oh no, no, that one's immune to yeah, that one's immune to art attacks. I just remembered. Fucking idiot. I just remembered. A wasted turn. Completely wasted because that bitch just got healed from it. Completely wasted. <sighs> I love it. Okay. Okay, what if I do it on this guy? I'm going to focus on trying to kill off one of these big ones. Because the big ones are the ones that actually spawn more enemies. There goes Estelle already, though. Alright, we got to salvage it. We got to salvage it. See what I mean, though? More of these fuckers. Okay. I mean, the little guys are less concerning, but it's still a problem. We gotta take out these big boys. They stop summoning. Alright, gonna tear all bomb on Jack. 
Josh. You're gonna heal yourself. As long as you live long enough to do so. In the meantime, keep chipping this big boy away. God, they're still summoning more. That's so annoying. Them, I guess. We're gonna get rid of this one big one. Oh my god, she got knocked out of her move? That's annoying. It's almost dead. Almost dead. Just let me finish it. God, for the love of God, kill it. Okay. Jesus. I get super annoyed by that. Alright, so this one defends Luciola. Weapon attacks will heal it. So we definitely have to hit this one with magic. Which means just go for her. Cool, let's just go for her. As I miss on my first attack. Cool. Okay, time to get those attack buffs back on, please. Kind of okay trying to trying to miss that guy. Fuck my ass, dude. Why do you have to miss, man? Why do you have to impede, man? here trying to kill a couple of these little fucks so there's less of them. Dude, stop missing! Oh my god with the missing. That is absolutely frustrating. Dude. That defense buff. Debuff, rather. Fucking sucks ass. Okay, uh, just, you know what, just tear old bomb on yourself. I'm gonna do a defense buff, I think. Wait, I thought she had defensive buff. Oh yeah, crest, sorry. Uh... Get annoyed by having this debuff bullshit. Now we'll keep on fucking that motherfucker up. Stop missing! Ugh! So fucking frustrating. Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. The misses are real right now. She didn't do the one that hit everybody, which is great. Last time she did the one that hit everybody and it fucked me over royally. That time she didn't do that. This is okay. Okay. So. I kinda wanna just go straight for the, the bitch face. Oops. Just moved the still out of the healing. Well, and I got knocked back into healing. But I also just got hit again, so it doesn't matter. Stop impeding me! Cut it out! Alright. Joshua, just keep focusing on this bitch. My only worry is, like, once you get her to a certain point, is that when she starts using her, her fucking kill move? Probably keep my HP up as high as I can. Yeah. 
I really should try to get rid of that guy. But I can't really take the time to focus on him right now. Not with magic, like I would want to. All these little bastards are weak to Earth, right? Yes, they are. Slightly weak, not like overly weak, but yes. <sighs> Which makes it tempting to try and hit him with some of this fucking titanic roar or something. Oh, this hits everything? We're doing it. That's worth it. That's worth it just because it hits all. I didn't even realize it hit all. I'm the dumb. I should have done that sooner. Well then. That was 100% worth it. Alright, so this could be bad. Actually, you know what? We didn't have the defensive debuff this time, so we were okay. Nice. That is a nice way to clear out a bunch of motherfuckers, though, for real. Very nice. Uh, who's hurting the most? Herself? Oof, now she's doing the fucking multiplier move again, which is always fun. Should just take the time to heal right now. Actually, you know what? Morale. Oh, it didn't hit Joshua. Shit. Oh, shit. That's why that fight's annoying, because Estelle... Oh, my God. It, like, she can switch spot... Oh, my God. I didn't even realize that's how it worked. She actually switched spots with my homie. That's not okay. Alright, well, now I know what to do right now. I know exactly what I want to do right now. Estelle, you're gonna do motherfucking... You're gonna do that Titanic Roar again. It'll help us figure out which one of y'all is the real one. I don't know if that actually hit myself, but... Pretty sure it helped us get the real bitch. Oh, come on. opportunity to get that EP healed up a little bit. So right now, we're only going to be fucked if this bitch busts out that Firestorm move again that hits everybody where, with her special. Right now, we don't have the defensive debuff, though, so we should be okay. That sucks him in. That's actually very helpful. God damn it. Okay, that's fine. Uh, use this opportunity to just heal Julia. I have Estelle do Quake again, because that was actually the way to go. Although I don't know if I have enough for it. I don't. Fuck. Fuck. <sighs> My CP, I'm just burning through it, bro. Burning through it. Okay. Now can I use the fucking Titanic roar? Meanwhile, uh... Meanwhile, oh, he has it too? Motherfucker. Let's do it twice. Fuck it. Just for the sake of something. I don't know. Uh, yeah, let's just get in a better, more grouped together position.
I would like to buff everybody again if I could. Um, dude, she multiplied again. What the hell? That's too many multiplications. Okay, you do Titanic now. Meanwhile, Estelle can do something else. Uh, oh, morale. That's what I wanted to do. Almost forgot. <sighs> and I guess in the meantime, you do this because it'll hit something. Dude, look how many fucking replications she has now. Goddamn. Can we stop it with the replications, though? Almost got her dead, man. Almost got her dead. Let's go. Okay, now we should be good. How much HP do you got left? 3,000? You're definitely weak to Earth. Just hit him with whatever Earth we got. Low level, high level, don't matter. Just hit him with it. Just hit him with whatever you got, bro. Meanwhile, don't let him do it move. There we go. We are victorious once again. That's another motherfucking Ouroboro down, baby. Let's go. Joshua learned Phantom Raid. Ooh. Sounds pretty sick. <laughs> I see. It seems you have the right to go farther up. What? Luciola, you'll withdraw then? Yes. I don't really have a reason to remain. Wait, hold on a sec. But what about you and, and Shira? Shira, yes. The karma between us remains uneven. So I'm certain fate will bring us together again someday. I mean, the fact that we're not actually killing these guys means it doesn't matter that I'm missing out on some dialogue. Anyway. Above us are the three most dangerous people you have ever met. Take care, because even one mistake will cost you your life. Farewell then, my loves. I completely forgot what voice I was doing for her before, but it doesn't matter. Hey! She's gone. Phew. Seems she was testing us. It is strange. She does not seem much like the other Ouroboros members we've met. Hmm. Even so, I imagine the Silver Streak will be disappointed when she hears of this. Yeah, but I don't know. Maybe it's for the best. I get the feeling the two of them meeting would be kind of a problem, too. Yes. It's something for another day, I think. Regardless, Luciola is gone, but our job isn't done yet. We should pay attention to her warning and proceed carefully. Right. It matters especially for this scene has a very different ending. Eh, yeah, but... Eh. Whatever. I'm gonna be very confused in three. Nah, I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Barrier to upper levels and transport gate now unlocked. Oh boy. Okay, so is this the moment where I finally backtrack? This might be a good time. This is probably the best time because I think like like uh, yeah like Luciola just said we're probably gonna go fight the hardest of enemies now, and it might behoove us to be a little bit more prepared. I just want to go buy some items more than anything. By the way, did I even set up my freaking ordinance? Nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> oh, I'm so smart. Uh, okay, so... 
Mind four is probably a good choice there. Let's do Evade 4? Yeah, that's probably a good idea. They have pretty good quartz already, like overall. Um, shop. Did I check this shop? I did not. Yeah, water, wind, wood, and mirage. Very tempting. Yeah, dude, ornaments. Who, who fucking needs them? Ornaments are for the weak, bro. I think you overestimate, or I should say, because you're uh, so experienced with the game of Swords Age, and you take so much time when you set up all your shit, maybe you underestimate, or I should say, overestimate, or I don't know what I'm trying to say. Point is, Maybe you over-prepare. Prepare more than you really need. I mean, sure, the battles will be a struggle because I haven't grinded and I'm not setting up, like, the most ideal deal setups. But whatever works, man. That's the beauty of a blind playthrough. Or the pain of a blind playthrough. Whichever you look, however you look at it. We're not going to tell Shira about what just happened. Uh, she might be mad. All right, so let's hit up the shop. Okay, so I'm going to buy some more tier all bombs because I'm down to four. Yeah. I need to sell some shit. Uh, time to start selling shit. Do I have anything that's just worth a bunch of money? Hell yeah, I do. Snakeheads. Sell them all. Trout? Fuck them. Pearl glass? Sure. Carp? Hella carp. Get them all out of here. Rock eaters? It's a thousand more. Which I'm gonna be able to get out of that. So, okay. Tier all I just wanted to buy enough so I had 20 of them. Which is like all my goddamn money I just fucking dealt with. Uh the rest should be fine. That's really the only one I wanted more of. I'm not gonna lie. Also, can I heal here? If I go into the bedrooms, can I heal? Yes, okay. So all I really wanted to do was heal and buy some shit. I think I'm just gonna stick with this party, I really am. I mean, until it doesn't work for whatever reason, I might as well. And I bet you most people who play this game probably don't pick this party just for the sake of the fact that they don't use these people very often. So maybe this is a different kind of blind playthrough than you've ever seen. Let's get back to that tower, y'all. Head on to the next Ouroboros, and if they're gonna go in order, then that means Ren is up next. And we know how the Ren fight went last time. She was by far the hardest of the four. By far. Is 
It's definitely some new dialogue for you. We'll see. There you go. You never know what you're going to get in a blind playthrough. Mm-hmm.